Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play, nope, to uh, my Pokemon Moon Party Blind Nuzlocke. Shut up, me, I'm not trying to talk to you. They say that back in the days when there was nothing here, not even this town, the people in the Tauros used to roam in hordes. Let's do it in the name of those people then. Wee! Oh, hello. Tauros kicks up all kind of hidden items that were buried in the ground. It's like he's passing them along to me. Come on, do that. Oh yeah, you can't. Um, if you clear Kiawa's trial, then you can ride on the back of a real Charizard. You can actually fight through the sky. That sounds awesome. Hello. Can't blow that up. How can I talk to this fat man then? Let me get off this tour. I'll see if I can do it then. Might find a revive. Right. Don't seem to be able to talk to that man. Oh well. Oh, look at that trombic of yours! It weighs less than 110 pounds, and it shouldn't take too much damage if we... Uh, even if it's hit with a move like Grass Knot. It's great how you can check the weight of your Pokémon and info like that in your Pokédex. That's nice. And also, Grass Knot would be bad against me, which is the other reason I wouldn't take much damage. But if we ignore all of that, it's fine. Hello, Magma. Oh, Magma, it doesn't have to burn up just about anything. It's a real champ when it comes to controlling its flames, but sometimes just want to eat something that's not charred to a crisp, right? That is true. Why have they got a hat on a thing? It reminds me of something from um, Ace Attorney did, in the first game, the final chapter. Did someone put a, hat, a cowboy hat on a cactus, didn't they? This is a great place. Whoa! They weren't there before, were they? <laughs> That's scary. Why has this guy got so many magmas? Paniola Town, the town we developed with our Pokemon. That's nice. Let's go in here and chat to everyone, see if anything interesting is happening. I'm not going to bother the cafe, nothing interesting happens there. Depending on a smaller town, alright, we we'll get by because we share our work with our Pokemon and they deign to help us with it. That's nice. Not sure if Hua healed me, but let's just do it anyway. Oh. You know how sometimes you seem to be alone, but you feel like someone's watching you? Do you think that's the Guardians watching? The folk at Paniola Ranch made all those big ramps in the fields around the ranch to help their Pokemon build up strong hips and legs. That's nice. What are you selling? No, thank you. Get out of here. Come on then, let's go around the back. Paniola Ranch lies up this way. It's pretty far off through there to Brooklyn Hill. Apparently folks have been riding on Tauros in the Aloha region since very long back. I guess you can understand how ride Pokemon became such a part of everyday life. Come on then. Oh, I'll get a new Pokemon in Paniola Ranch. Everyone who works on a ranch loves a good Pokemon battle. That's good. Hello. <coughs> Eat well, sleep well, then it's time for a proper battle! I think this might be an old lady, so I don't know why I gave her a man's voice, but... Madame Elizabeth. That's nice. Go on, Carbink. I'm like semi-decent against you. Here we go again! Wow, that Carbink's got good defense. Smackdown, crap! Let's take you out. Um, uh, who to use? Let's use Smood. Die. It's fast as well. Let's 
Is it dead? Yes, good. I got a crit, that's why I died probably. But who cares, it's dead now. Yeah, Yomp leveled up. Good. I've had enough, I can't fight anymore! That wasn't a voice at all, but there you go. Anyway, I'm going to go heal quickly. So I will see you in a second. Let's carry on this area. Oh! Oh, you got a big truck, alright? Well, you got a good sense of timing. The captain's actually here now, so come on! Come on down! There she is. Thanks for stopping by. The Moo Moo milk from Paniola Ranch is the best. It's so rich and creamy when you use it in white sauce and other things. Mmm, the taste can't even be described. Oh, by the way, since I was lucky enough to run into you here, I'll do you a little favor. What do I get now? Oh, Stoutland, that's cool. See, Stoutland can sniff out items for you that are buried in the dirt where you can't even see them. When you're riding Stoutland, pressing the B button to use the Stoutland search is what it's all about. Get up there and try it. There's all kind of stuff laying around waiting for you to find it. If you go all the way down Route 5, you'll come out on Brooklyn Hill. My friend Lana is up there, so say hi to her for me if you see her. That's nice. Let's try that Stoutland then. That's nice. Good, Taurus. They look so stupid. Those Poke Beans that you can get from the cafes and the Pokemon centers are harvested from Poke Palego. Did you know that? I have a trumpet wake me up every morning at a set of time. Well, that's what I let it think. The truth is that the neighbor's alarm clock wakes me up every day. That's mean. Hopefully, this rock rough I got in trade won't hardly listen to a thing I say. Oh, because I don't have that many stamps from the kahunas. Maybe you need to get some more then. I prefer riding the Stoutland to riding, um... Tauros. It feels fun. It's not as fast though, sadly. What are we going to get for here anyway? Oh, cool, a mud braid. That's nice. Come oh, on then, let's catch. Capture on. Let's put it to sleep. Whatever. Let's leech it. I don't trust Mega Drain not to murder it, so let's just go straight for a poke. No, not a Pokeball. I meant an old uh, Great Ball. I mean, oh well, we'll see what happens. Oh, there you go. We caught a Mud Bray. Yay! Mud, yay! Mud Bray's data. It has a stubborn individualistic disposition, eating dirt, making mud and playing in the mire all form part of its daily routine. That's nice. What should we call it? Fud. There we go. See you, Fud. Oh, hello. Are you raising Pokemon? Yep. Glenn. 
I just got one of them. Pretty good. There we go, well done, Smooth. It's like the battle never happened at all. Maybe in addition to providing care, raising means drawing our talents. I guess so. Whoever gets you through the night. Do, 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 do. Oh, I got one of them already. I mean, I can't catch it anyway, but that is still a true fact. Come on, Smooth. Oh, it's calling friends. It had no friends. And it did basically nothing. Well done, Lily Pop. Riding on Saturn is always a good idea. There might have been items that you can't see. Oh. There we go. I think there might be a Zygarde over there. Yep. That's good. Oh, I see the widow over there. Right, is there anything else we could have caught on this ranch? Not so far. Uh oh. Oh, that's cute. Help me! Oh, it did have friends this time. <laughs> oh, that was quite strong. And I couldn't move. No, stop being friends. It's rude. Okay, you're out of this mode because you can't do anything. Um, go on, Vald. He won't care about some bite. Oh, that's an extra powerful baby doll eyes now. That is actually slightly annoying because I need my attack, really. Let's kill this first one. Yeah, it's moved good level 18. Oh! Oh my god! That was intense. Um, what should we have? Let's be bad. At least he won't be affected much by a takedown. It's a strong little thing, this one. Oh, I don't care about that. Do, 
Please don't bring another one. Oh my god, just die! Quick claw, good. I'm gonna kill that one. Perfect. And we'll kill that one before it even gets a chance to use that helping hand. Okay, stop killing the other one now. Oh my god, this is so stupid. No, just stop! <laughs> What's going on? Good. No, that's the wrong one to helping hand. Oh, it's alright. As nice as it is for experience, this has gone on forever. Okay, come on, we can get it now. There we go! Oh dear. Let's do some healing. There we go. Um, let's put Vald up first. Yeah, let's run that corner, I guess, whatever it is. Pokemon Nursery, find some Poggy eggs. Let's have a look in there. Hello, do you want to use this and awaken your Pokemon's hidden powers? Oh, that's nice. Hidden power changes time depending on the Pokemon that learns it. Somehow I can tell what type that move will be. If you'd like, I'll check what type of po uh, hidden power your Pokemon will learn. Would you like to know this? Yeah, go for it. Be good if it just told you there. I didn't have to click on them one by one. If Pokemon Ghost, that's pretty rubbish for him. Psychic. That could be worth it. Because then he could kill fighting types. Poison for... Who was poison? Jockey, that's rubbish. Actually, that might be really good. Ghost for um, Smooth. That's basically pointless. Ground for Yomp, that's quite good for taking out electric types. What's badge got? Grass! Okay, everyone got really good ones there, for the most part. What's the strength of hidden power naturally? Oh, but it's a special move, so it's not actually very good for half these people. But... I'm going to teach it to two of them. Badge, you're going to learn Hidden Power Grass to take out ground types. If you the need ever comes, get rid of Light Screen. And Jocket is going to learn Hidden Power Poison, because he gets stabbed from that as well. Get rid of Lick. There we go. Okay. Anyway, we are going to end the episode here, but next time we will carry on going through the ranch until we get somewhere useful. Um, hopefully you enjoyed this. If you did, feel free to like and subscribe, and you can subscribe by clicking in the top left right now, top right to watch the last episode, bottom right to watch the next episode when it airs, and the top, the bottom left to go to the playlist. Anyway, see you later. Bye-bye.